Ranch, one of Houston's hometown heroes, famously turned his furniture stores into shelters for Harvey victims after devastating floods. And now he is opening his doors once again, this time hosting a massive absolutely huge Thanksgiving feast for anybody and everybody. Joining us now, Jim McAvale, also known, of course he's known as this, Mattress Matt. Good to have you here, sir. Um, your, your story and what you've done for people just keeps getting better. First, remind us what you did during uh, Hurricane Harvey for those who were immediately displaced during the storm. Well, first of all, Griff, Molly, and Todd, thanks for having me on. Thanks for being here. You know, when Hurricane Harvey hit on Saturday night, Sunday morning, it got really bad. We decided to open both of our big stores, the one in North Freeway in Houston and the one in Richmond, Texas, in West Houston, as shelters. So we did that. We housed about 300 people for two or three nights in a row. And uh, it was one of the great times of uh, our life, myself and my employees, because we were able to serve those people, and the people there were great. So we opened the store and sheltered the people, and uh, the people could not have been more wonderful. And here we are, so many m months later, and, and people are still working and struggling to recover. Many of them still don't have don't have kitchens, really, quite frankly. Uh, so why were you inspired to do this big meal? Well, during the when the people were there at the shelter in the stores, I noticed the best time of the day was when they all had dinner together. And, total strangers were forming relationships so one of the employees that works with me came up with the idea why don't we do this thanksgiving in a bigger and better way and invite the entire community out to gallery furniture and see if we can have 10 15 maybe 20,000 people eat thanksgiving dinner together we thought it was a great idea and it all comes to fruition today it's a beautiful day we'll have lots of people inside the store on the dining room tables eating thanksgiving dinner we'll have 2,000 seats outside in the wonderful 70 degree weather here today in Houston so it should be a great day we sit we looking for a sense of unity and community hey Jim I just want to ask you quickly uh, you know clearly the devastation of the floods uh, and I had the fortunate uh, to cover for Fox News but uh, as you are having this huge feast today tell us though as millions of Americans are giving thanks for what they have around the country some in Houston have still not recovered some of these floodplain areas uh, that have not come back yet how is Houston doing as uh, we turn our thoughts to you and your community there people in Texas are tremendously resilient so they are getting better but there's still entire communities that still are in the rebuilding process so it's been very tough. A lot of people lived in a house for 20, 30, 40, 50 years, never had an inch of water, then they had six feet of water with no flood insurance. Just devastating. So there's lots of recovery still going on, lots of hopes, lots of prayers. So we think by having this Thanksgiving feast today, we can bring some more joy to people in Houston. The Astros winning the World Series was very cathargic, and people all over Houston sharing uh, a meal today, breaking beds together is a great way to to keep the rebuilding process going and the recovery process going and the healing. Mattress Mac, I want to get your one requirement that you have for people today. What is the one requirement for people showing up? One requirement to come out to the gallery furniture feast today is you got to have a good appetite because there's lots of great food going <laughs> to be there. Oh, man. 2,450 pounds of turkey, 625 pounds of sweet potatoes, and a shuttle service, which blows my mind. So you guys have really put a lot of work into this. That's something to be thankful for. Yeah. Metro service, Metro's given us a great shuttle service. Lots of people are going to be there today. We're thankful to be in Houston, thankful for the recovery, and most of all, thankful for the great citizens who inspire us every day. You inspire us, Mattress Mac. Have a great Thanksgiving, and thank you so much for all that you do. All right, there's always that one person on your shopping list who has everything. Well, <laughs> consider that problem solved. That's all. I can't wait to find out what that story's about. <laughs> yeah, exactly. That picture's incredible. Uh, and uh, New York City is buzzing. The Macy's Day, uh, Thanksgiving Day Parade. Uh, the fun already getting started. We will take you there live next. And my family made the trip up here for the holiday. The story of our first Thanksgiving. I can't oh, believe it. Hi, guys. Happy do that. Hi. What a treat. Awesome. Happy Thanksgiving. Hi, guys.